In 1949, 10 drilling contractors began working together. The history of this trade group for oil and gas drillers stretches back more than 70 years. Today, a historic change. The Canadian Association of Oil Well Drilling Contractors is scratching out the words oil and drilling from its name. To reflect its expanded mandate and leading role in the oil and gas, hydrogen, helium, geothermal, and carbon capture utilization and storage sectors. Some don't welcome oil's fall from prominence. We don't want to talk about the um, dirty thing in our backyard there, so it's a shame that we have to do something like that to take it out. The name change comes amid growing environmental pressure. In just the last week, investors forced ExxonMobil to commit to better climate reporting by adding directors. A European court ordered Royal Dutch Shell to cut emissions faster, which some environmentalists call a landmark case. And in Alberta, Suncor Energy told investors it will be net zero by 2050. We understand where all our emissions come from. We understand the technology sets that are required. And we have specific initiatives underway that get us started on this. Still, getting all the way to net zero is a challenge, especially as the industry pumps out record amounts of oil. It just makes no sense to commit to net zero and promise sustainability while increasing production of oil for export. For the drillers, removing the word oil from their name may change the organization's mandate, but the group says it still supports a prosperous oil patch for years to come. Kyle Bax, CBC News, Calgary.